Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Grandma. This is a just sales video. We're gonna go over what has sold over the last week or so. Haven't sold a whole lot of stuff. It's actually been kind of slow, but we're gonna go over that. Sorry for not posting a video in a while. I have had a sinus infection, which has been kind of gross. Been working on bathroom vanities in my wife's in my wife's parents' house. Um, nephews and nieces are down from Indiana. So we have been playing a lot of disc golf, going to the zoo, twin craziness going on here. I haven't been feeling of the best spirits. Uh, I was hacking a lot of nasty stuff out of my sinuses for about the past five days, but I do feel a lot better now. Update on the Tuba City job. They did offer me a job. The offer was lower than I had expected. It did come along with a two year commitment. So I told them that, that the uh, the offer was lower than I expected, so I would decline it. Um, I still might do contracting out there sometime in March or April. I have applied to a couple jobs in Florida, so we're gonna see if any of those pan out. But I need to get something on my resume for 2018. I feel like uh, I didn't work a lot of 2017. I did just post a giveaway on my Instagram for a Dymo printer. If you saw Thrift Battle, then you know what's up with that. It was actually my last item on thrift battle and it got defeated by the rally route. So all you gotta do is go on the Instagram, tag your favorite reseller in the comments. And there are a ton of comments on here. And I would say that the, the uh, rally routes are probably the most commented. They're probably getting a ton of tags from this post, but they are, uh, they are inspiring people to step up their game. So that's good. So we'll give away that. Um, we'll give away that printer on Monday, February 28th. 7th or 28th, whatever that is, random.org, generate it, but let's get into just sales. Sold two hats on Etsy, um, not that one. Probably because of St. Patrick's Day coming up, Aaron Go Bud, this Budweiser trucker hat, made in the USA, sold for $29. Had this for a while, and I wanna say this other hat has been listed less than a month. It's a San Diego Zoo Wild Animal Park uh, with the with the nerd propeller on top, scrunchy back, uh, size large, made in the USA from the San Diego Zoo, uh, color blocked or whatever. This sold for 44 bucks on Etsy, so those are pretty good sales. Sold a parallel print server that I took from my brother-in-law. I was just sitting at the house. Sold that for $29. Sold within about a uh, two-week period. Sold a Betamax player. Uh, was gonna use this for Thrift Battle, but it did not work. I put a tape in it. It ate the tape and did not spit the tape back out. So I sold it as is for parts. Paid five dollars for it. Sold it for thirty nine plus twenty nine shipping. These were uh, Brogues size triple A Nettleton vintage uh, wingtips. Sold these for I think fifty. 59 free shipping. This is a Yakima bike rack dish for the top of a car. It has the mounting hardware and everything that sold for 51 free shipping. So it was a broken keyboard sold as is for parts paid like $2.99 sold for $12.99 as is for broken as is for parts. Got rid of that. Bought this in Japan with Mr. Cody Orgel uh, during the bike tour when all of our cameras were breaking. This was a Japanese only camera, like it was only in Japanese. It was a Sony, it did shoot in HD. If you can see there, it's like all in Japanese only. Uh, still sold it for $35. I got it for, I wanna say around 15 or 20. Used it in Japan for the bike tour vlogs and then brought it home and sold it. So that was pretty cool. Sold another pair of these weightlifting gloves for $11.82. Paid about 220 something for this. Uh, listed it for 500 sold within two days. It was brand new with tags. Amazing brand Filson. I uh, got that from a Nordstrom rack, and I actually found another one. Um, this is a bigger one, but it did not have the, the Filson tags on it. It is still brand new without tags. Paid 210 for this one. I should be able to get around 500 also. That's a nice shot of the Filson brand. They're known for brass zippers. It'll say Filson on the zippers. These leather straps right here are their style. And then of course it'll say Filson. This is a uh, amazing company out of Seattle. It makes amazing bags. So if you ever see Filson at a thrift, you will hit the old man brand jackpot. And uh, you can also make money flipping it if you find it on sale at a Nordstrom rack, if it's for the right price for the right bag.
Andrew bought my Guitar Hero book early February, so thank you very much, Andrew. And Michael purchased a Kuji style Obermeyer sweatshirt. So this is like the first Kuji style I was able to sell. The color was cool. Made in Hong Kong, acrylic wool, size medium. 45 plus 22 shipping, so 67. Sold some trim to fit boot laces for a whopping $6.29. Sold this wireless Bluetooth Apple keyboard for $15 because this is like corroded shut i if you can see that right there it's all boogered up i was trying to get into it but i could not get this to budge so we sold it as is for 15 dollars. i didn't pay anything for it sold a ps1 with ejection issues uh, everything works other than the eject button um, sticks as you can see it doesn't want to close right now but if you play with it a little bit i can get it to close but that sold for $17.99. I don't know how much I paid for this or if I got it into a lot, I really don't remember. We sold a pre-boxed VCR from the box wall that sold for $53.99. Sold this Magnavox DVD recorder and VCR on eBay for a hundred and something bucks. Yeah, I, I believe I'm getting drop shipped to somewhere on Amazon because they told me to leave out all packing slips and everything because it's a gift. So still a good sale but someone's making money off of me. And that was just sales. That was about a week and a half worth of sales and it really was not a ton of sales. But uh, thanks everybody for watching. If you haven't already, give this video a thumbs up. If you have any encouraging comments or amazing sales of your own, feel free to share those sales with me in the comments. If you want the Dymo printer, make sure to go tag your favorite reseller in my latest Instagram post and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, bye. We're counting out the cash, going to buy another car. How much is that, Mom? $2,000. Is it $2,000? Oh, I don't know. You oh, said that's what it was. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 1800. Gotta put more out. Why don't you use some bigger? I'm sure doesn't want bigger ones. I'm trying to get rid of the 20s. No, I just like getting rid of the 20s. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I think that's 2,000. Okay. I was out of the Prius fund.